Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is noun phrase 144. The noun phrase today is Easy Street. Okay, let's take a look at the note here. Uh, easy Street basically means one has uh, attained a carefree or worry-free lifestyle. Usually because somebody has come into a lot of wealth. Well, one way or another, you got a lot of money, and you know, that's the idea. That's what it alludes to. So now that you have a lot of money, your life can be more carefree. You don't have to worry, no money problems. So life is easy for you. So now you're on easy street. Okay, let's continue. Uh, we often hear someone say one is on easy street or used as an idiom to be living on easy street. Uh, they say it is acceptable to be used with both lowercase and uppercase. So you can see the words easy street with either a small e and a small s or a big e and a big s. The idea why it could be capitalized suggests it is like the actual name of a real street. He's living on easy street, like the name of the street is actually called easy street. All right, let's continue. They say the phrase started to be used around the 1890s, and even Charlie Chaplin had a film named Easy Street, you know, probably about somebody who came into a lot of money. Uh, it has been used in many titles of films and songs since that time. Okay, and of course, we just we have three examples here. Uh, example number one, he has been living on Easy Street ever since... He made a bundle of money from cryptocurrencies. Maybe he invested early and, you know, it just multiplied and he made a lot of money from that. And he's been on easy street ever since then. Or number two here, you can say uh, the title of that book is Five Ways to Get to Easy Street. All right, so you can really see how it's used as a noun phrase. Obviously, this is probably a book trying to tell you five ways that you could, you know, become wealthy or make a lot of money. Okay, and number three here, uh, that gold digger married this old millionaire so she could be on easy street after he passes away. Okay, great. I uh, hope you got it. I hope it was informative. Um, thank you for your time. Bye-bye.